You ever feel stuck, mired in an unhappy marriage, or bogged down in debt, or you ever just feel stuck? Her affliction began on April 21st, 2008. She suffered a massive brain cell stroke. She has endured 11 surgeries, and she fights daily to regain her strength. I should be in heaven right now. Then at least everyone's pain would eventually come to an end. And then suddenly, before these thoughts had even fully landed in my head and heart, I felt a deep awakening of the Word of God. I know you can't fight this. That doesn't matter. I have chosen you. Live a life worthy of the special calling you have received. And I felt fresh determination to press on and persevere. In so many words, Jesus told her what he told the man at the pool of Bethesda, stand up, take up and walk. Stuck for 38 years at the edge of a pool. When Jesus saw him and knew he had been ill for a long time, he asked him, would you like to get well? That was an odd question for Jesus to ask that sick person. I have never, ever, not once, nary come close to asking a sick person, do you want to get well? I just assume they want to. The sick man said, for I have no one to help me into the pool. While I'm trying to get there, someone else always gets in ahead of me. Really? You can't convince anybody to help you? Somebody else always gets there before you? Nobody else wants to help you? Are you serious? You get healed, you gotta get up. You gotta get on with life. So do you really want to be healed? Did you know that not even Jesus can help someone who refuses to be healed? Not even Jesus can help someone who refuses to be healed. A message of this miracle is simply this. You gotta take action. You gotta do something. You gotta write the letter, apply for the job, call your offender, get help, Jesus said. Stand up and then pick up your mat. When he wants you red hot moving forward, he's got a future for you and he's telling you, you gotta stand up, you gotta pick up and you gotta start walking. You've been sitting here in Bethesda too long. Your best days are not behind you. Your best days are ahead of you. Do you believe this? Stand up, take up.